Now yell, fan mail call Friday? No, please do not. <laughs> I'm serious. If you do that, I will walk away from filming and I won't film with you for a long time. And also you won't be invited to my birthday party. <laughs> oh man. Which is in April and I will remember. Literally we're gonna be out of town for your birthday, Billy Eilish. You're not gonna come. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome back to Box Pop Beauty. I'm Michael. I'm Kendall. And today, for you, it is Friday, which means it is fan mail call. That's not good. <laughs> Friday. That's what happens when Kendall threatens me <laughs> because our child is sleeping. We're going through a transition in sleep. Also, apparently, we're going through a gang transition where Kendall's hood, literally. Yep. So anyway, today is where we take fan mail, mail call. Come on together, fan mail call Friday. Today we have a trade, a purchase, and a random act of kindness. So what do you want to start with? I want to end with the random act of kindness. End with the random act of kindness. Let's start with the purchase because the purchase throw it, throw it out there really easy. I got this for actually a pretty good deal. I was pretty happy about it. Um. This is, so we, we pre-ordered a mystery box uh, that, what? Just. We pre-ordered a mystery box, and in that mystery box, we're guaranteed to get a Stone Cold Steve Austin autograph Uncle Pop. So I'm pretty excited about that. That mystery box is coming to the channel eventually. Um, so there are two other wrestlers that I really care about. Uh, the Rock, which I'm probably never going to own of The Rock. Funko Pop signed. We have his autograph. What are you doing? Checking for hair. We have an autograph from The Rock that we got from Primetime, uh, Primetime Signatures Autograph City. We have one of those, but I did have an opportunity to get this Funko Pop. I missed the pre-order. I missed when Zobi did it on their black box item, uh, but I did end up getting it from the company on eBay, and I think I got it for a pretty good deal. They were asking $300, uh, after doing offering, remember if anybody on eBay has the or best offer, offer, go for it. Like, what do you have to lose? Um, Jew tip of the day. So I offered, I think I like originally offered like 200. Anyway, we ended up meeting at 250. But the cool thing about meeting at 250 is then I applied for and got the eBay credit card, which gave you $50 credit. So I basically got this for $200. Which is pretty cool. I think I got a good deal. Are you waiting for me to... I'm waiting for you to like... Validate you? No, to say like something terrible. Like how could you? How could you what? I've spent $200. I am so beyond that. Like we're, what, two years into this now? Oh, cool. Sweet. All right. So anyway, so I got this guy. And what's really cool about this is we recently just obtained a... And Kendall actually likes this wrestler, by the way. Uh, we just obtained a Paul Bear autographed 8x10. So I'm going to do maybe a little display with the Paul Bear 8x10. But I did obtain the Undertaker signed Funko Pop. And it is absolutely gorgeous. He has a great signature. Kendall really appreciates the purple paint pen. And it it's has... It's not the color I would have chosen, but I like it. What color would you have chosen for that? White? Yellow. Yellow? Yellow's good. Uh, it has the Fitterman, uh, Fitterman, Fitter, Fitterman Sports uh, COA, Undertaker COA, and the JSA Witnessed. So it has the dual COA stickers on the side, which I think is really cool. Matching card. Really happy to have that in my collection. It's going to go great when I get Stone Cold, and maybe one day I will get The Rock. Maybe one day. I actually like all the wrestlers so far, honestly. All the ones that we've watched the series on. Yeah, it'd be great. Like, Andrea the Giant's a great... Like, she actually really enjoys the um, those two, the Most Wanted Treasures and then the Biography. She actually loves those shows. Mm -hmm. She's been enjoying them. So anyway, let's get to the trade. I did a trade with uh, Bill Goss. I still have to send it. But we did a trade. Originally, this started out as Bill purchasing something from me. And then Bill pulled this. I think it was pulled in an OC Celebrity Marketing Hollywood box. And uh, I decided I wanted it for the collection. 
so I traded for it. Let's see. Oh, there might be a letter, babe. We should start adding more letters when we send stuff. Oh, read that. This is for the trade. Here are a couple duckies Cassidy wanted to give Xander. Oh. Wow. That's so nice. Here's one. A ducky. A chef duck. Chef ducky. Oops. Very sweet. Oh, here's another one. Ship duck. A little ahoy duck. Aw. And then... Way to be awesome. I, I like him the best because his arms are up. I want to make sure I'm not missing any ducky, so give me a second here. That's very sweet. Yeah, those will go into Xander's bath. He oh. loves the bath. Around the tub. Okay, so here are these. Uh, we did do kind of a bigger trade, got some 8x10s coming, but this was the main piece of the trade. And I'm pretty excited to add it to the collection. Kendall, I don't know if Kendall will care about this or not. We did have this person's autograph on an 8x10, but I had no really desire to keep that. Um, but when I saw this was available, I knew I wanted this really bad. It literally flew off and stuck back to you. I hope that's on camera. That was, that was like a magic trick. Aww. So this is a Pee Wee Herman Funko Pop signed by Paul Rubens. So if you watched the last video, you know that we talked about that we did a trade where we got Paul Rubens autograph and this was it. Uh, it is Beckett witnessed. And uh, what's cool about this is it's signed on the top, your pal Pee Wee Herman, and then it's signed Paul Rubens. And I have kind of a, I don't know, I have kind of like a soft spot for um, things that are signed by the character and then signed by the actor. Like one of my favorite pieces that we have in the collection is from Alan Tudyk. And it's signed as um, Ray Nearly from the show Con Man. Uh, he signed it as, as his character, Ray Nearly, and then he signed Alan Tudyk. So I really love this. Uh, thank you for the trade, Bill. That is going to be going into a pop armor once I get some and staying in the collection. Did you ever watch Pee Wee? Was Pee Wee, like, was it, like, very progressive and that, like, men can wear makeup if they want type of thing? I honestly don't know. Or, like, because he obviously has blush on and his eyebrows are done and stuff. He so kind like... of, like, looked like a doll. There's, it's not like part of the show, like a premise. It's Pee Wee's part. Playhouse. Who? But what is Pee Wee? Like he's a, just a person. He's the host, kind of like the main character. He's not supposed to be a doll or something. I honestly don't remember. I just remember that he had his house. The biggest thing I remember is I remember Cherry, and I remember um, the genie in the box. Make it like a high, make a hiney ho. That's not good. What? It's annoying. What is? That sound you just made. Make a like a hi, make a hiney ho. That's not a sound. That's words. It's not. I it promise is. it isn't. Look it up. Actual words. Okay. Last thing I have. Random act of kindness. This is from Jeff from the Fig Pin Chasers community. Um, I met Jeff when we went when when I went down for the Fig Pin Warehouse uh, Awesome Party, Fig Pin Wop party um and jeff posted in the fig pin community that he found after he left so if you guys didn't watch that fig pin video basically what you did is you went there you got a token you turn that token in and you got an artist proof pin then you can buy more stuff to get more tokens but the whole point was you turn the token in which i wanted to keep a token because the token had the date it had a bunch of cool stuff on it um and so Jeff posted in the uh, in the Figpin community, he posted that he found that he had pocketed one of the coins. So I said, uh, so nice. would you send it? And so he sent it to us so I could put it up. This is, again, if you guys don't know, this is literally all Figpin, this entire thing. Speaking of that, go check out, if you haven't already, Hero Complex displays. This is all Hero Complex displays, and they have just released... 
they're single fig pin displays. They you can go purchase four dollars, super cheap, uh, if you need single displays. Um, but yeah, so he got one of this, and uh, the funny thing about the token, you see, so it's a the fig pin warehouse awesome party. So WAP, and then what does this say? Special token for us. So what is that? S T F U. Oh. Okay. <laughs> and it's really cool. It's just on the back here. It's got the date August twenty eighth, twenty twenty one. Uh, I think it's got the GPS coordinates of it. Um, it's just a really cool coin. So I'm gonna get kind of like a coin display and put it up here. And uh, you should take like a good picture of the front and back and insert it. I think they can see it now. Babe, who can see that? They can look it. That's better. So I really wanted this coin. So thank you, Jeff. And then he was also kind enough to send me. Oh, this is cool. He sent me a couple uh, fig pin chasers. I really thought this was going to be like a heavy coin, but it isn't. It's kind of light. Yeah. Like compared to the BAM coins. Oh. You know? Yeah. I thought it was going to be like hefty, but it's not. It's nice. If you had to carry this around for an event, like they're not that bad. It's a nice coin. Um, he sent me some fig pin chasers group. Uh, I will link the group down below. Go check them out. Best, uh, best fig pin group on Facebook. Fig pin chasers. Uh, go check them out. And thank you again, Jeff. Thank you, Bill. Thank you, Fitterman Sports. Um, that's it for this fan mail call Friday. Thank you for our ducks. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, Thank you, Cassidy, for the Thank ducks you, for Cassidy, Xander. Thank you, Cassidy, for the ducks. Really appreciate it. Hopefully, uh, something that I'm sending uh, is for you as well, Cassidy. So, hopefully, you enjoy it. See you guys next video. Bye. Thanks for watching, everybody. Make sure you like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. See you next time. Bye.